welcome back to the channel. This is Pink Lady, and today is our March unboxing video. Yay! And if you notice, the light's different. I decided let's not try my nice little ring light I have because it's just too bright on me. It washes me out, whatever. So we're seeing how this is the light in my living room, pretty much, or what do you call it, like TV room or something. But we're going to see how this is, and you guys let me know down in the comments if you like this lighting better, or do you guys prefer the, uh, the, um, the ring light. But anyways, guys, my white wall, Walt Life Box came today, and we're going to do our March opening of the Walt Life Box. As you can see, it is here with me, and you know, to tell you the truth, guys, this box came... Um, with tape on it, so I'm assuming I'm getting something kind of big in this. So, I don't know. It's kind of feeling a little heavy, and it's kind of, you know, kind of bulky, but let's see what March has to bring. And also, guys, I'm going to tell you now, since I probably won't tell you tomorrow, but tomorrow's the first day of spring, so yay, happy first day of spring. That's tomorrow, but... I'm excited for warm weather. I'm personally more like warm weather than in anything else in the world. I hate cold weather. I hate basically anything cold. <laughs> I'm more of a warm person. I'm more like, I don't like summer, but because it's like a little too hot, but I mean, it still got warmth, but I prefer more of the spring kind of fall, like, you know, the half and half where it's like half cold, half warm, but more or less spring than, yeah. And also guys, if I don't say this now, but Nah, wait. I'll probably do another video. I'm just going too much ahead of myself. And also, guys, I don't know what else to do. <laughs> but, for one, we've got to do so we can open this box is to put on the Mickey ears. So we're all ready to go. I don't like this little whatever thingy, but hopefully, hopefully this works better with my hair being in a ponytail than freaking, yeah. I don't know. I think it's about as far as I'm going with my ears. Yay, me. <laughs> but anyways, guys, let's get open the box. So, open sesame. And, the, ah, the box is not wanting to open. The first thing I see, and I gotta move this thing, otherwise it's gonna not open, is I got a Mickey hat. Hi. Now I'm so excited. It's a little Mickey cat ball cap. Now I can still go William style now. Maybe I can start wearing this instead. This might actually fit me a little bit better than these ears. <laughs> but because it's still Disney. But I'm excited, guys. I love it. Love it. I, I do like wearing caps, especially with my ponytail and everything like that. So, um, so yeah. Excitement, guys. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. And the next thing I see is some color pencils from the Lion Guard. Let me go, let's see. Oops. Gotta get realized. But yeah, little color pencils. Yay! I can color. Kind of cute. I mean, I know of the Lion Guard, but don't really watch it. Well, of course, it's like meant for more your. Um, kind of your preschool age and stuff. I mean, I've heard of it and everything, but like I said, I haven't, I never really watched anything fully. I mean, I've seen the episode episodes. I'm not saying like I'm totally like oblivious to like, but I know some of you do like the line guard. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying it's bad or anything. I just don't necessarily feel, yeah. I'm kind of more like, we'll stick with the movies. Like, the first two movies, yes, I like. The sec the one and a half was kind of like, oh, okay, it's just a little play on like, oh, this is how it was perceived on Timon and Pumbaa's side and, you know, all that. But anyways, but yes, I do know I like Garth, but it's not one of my favorites. But now we keep going. Um, ooh, we got something in the little whatever, the protected. Let's see what we got. Ooh, it's a pen. Of uh, what is it? What kind of pen is it? I gotta see what the pin is, guys. Ah. I think I think it's just like a Disney monorail pin, but but yeah. 
like this is what I'm talking about. They have these little pin collections that they do. So, but yeah, I think this is just a. It looks like the monorail from like Disney World and stuff. I don't know if Disneyland does. I'm not trying to say, but I don't know Disneyland very well because I haven't been. So I can't vouch. But I've been to Disney World like three times in my lifetime. So, but um, but yeah, this is the little thing that they do. They do the pin thing, and you can get this on the what in the Walt Life thing as a package just for pins. If you're an adamant pin collector for Disney, they do have one. It's kind of like the almost a cheaper one to get. But I'm more of those people that likes more than just pins. I started, I did get some pins when I was, you know, when I did visit Disney and stuff. But like I said, I'm not like, I'm not really fully into it. Like, oh my God, like I like every time I have to go or I see something, I want a pin. But yeah, got a little Disney pin. That's kind of awesome to add to my collection. Hopefully it's a, hopefully it's a, um, we call it a rare one that you don't get to see or you can't be able to trade or whatever. But, but yeah. And also, guys, oh, we got the little coin thing again, but sadly, we already got it now. So, so yeah, that's kind of upsetting. I'm still waiting for the rest, but I think we're almost there. I think we're halfway there. Don't quote me on it. I have to really go look. But, I mean, like I said, I hope I can and win a trip for to Disney World. And like I said, guys, I might do a join. I don't know for sure, but... We'll, we'll keep it as an option, but I don't know yet. But, but in all in all, we show us another letter besides a letter I already have. And the next thing I see, and I'm excited about this one, I really am, is I got a Beauty and the Beast coloring book. Ah! <laughs> I do love these little coloring adult coloring books. So, yeah, I got a Beauty and the Beast coloring book. I think they were paying attention to my videos when I said the last box didn't have anything Beauty and the Beast. Well, looky here, guys. They re they listened and I got it. So, but yeah. It's a nice little... It's not from the animated one. This is from the um the real life one, but I don't have this one yet, and so I'm excited. I do have a princess one, and I have a villains one, and I think that's it of Disney coloring books. I don't think I got anything else. I know I got a Disney villain because my best friend got me the Disney villain one year for Christmas. And my brother, I think the, the year before that, before I got the Disney villains one, he gave me the princess one. But I'm still working on it, by the way. But I do color. Just not very often, but I like to. But it does call me. But I'm excited. I got a Beauty and the Beast color book. I've, I've actually seen these around. And I always wanted to get one. I just never got to. But now, I do. Yay. <laughs> So excited! And like I said, I'm a Beauty and the Beast girl, even though I am wearing a Little Mermaid shirt, by the way. <laughs> and by the way, guys, if anybody would like to know, I did get this shirt at Walmart for five bucks, at least in my area. I don't know anybody else's area, but I was like, I can't pass up this shirt. <laughs> because I do like the Little Mermaid and all that, but disclaimer, that's where I got this shirt, if anybody wants to know. It's very, very obtainable, I guess you want to say <laughs> but anyways the next thing I see of course is our reading is cool bookmark like I said guys I might end up giving these away because I think I'm going to be start recording bookmarks I do read but I don't think I need a bookmark for like almost every book in my house I might be up to that here very eventually <laughs> for all the books I have here I have like a lot of books too some I did read and some I haven't read but what you gotta do when you have a busy life. <laughs> but anyways, the next thing I see are my postcards. And I got more than one. And it's the oh another Pixar from Nick Knock. I don't know if I've actually seen okay, this one's from Nick Knock of Pixar. I don't think I've ever seen this. I think it's one of those movies I did not see that had this little short. I know it's a short, but like I said, I haven't seen this, but yep. Yeah. There's that postcard, and the next one I have is from Tin Toy, and it's from Pixar, and it looks like it's from a short. I think I've seen this one, or I think these both are together. I'm not for sure if you guys want to let me know down in the comments, because I think they're naming, naming these, but I could be wrong. But, but yep, yeah, my little Pixar collage, my little postcard collage will get here pretty soon. It could be best if I didn't get Pixar ones. It'd be nice if there's some Disney ones. I know I got a Beauty and the Beast one, but 
I kind of wish I could get some like Disney animated ones, not just Pixar. I mean, don't get me wrong. I lo the Pixar ones are very, very cool, by the way. But I kind of would like to have a little bit of a Disney animated. Just that's a um, FYI to the people if they're watching. And of course, our little thing and it says thank you for ordering from Walt Life. You're great. You're great. We're all so lucky to have you. You always are lucky to have me because I am the best Disney nerd ever. <laughs> Especially for Kansas, I think. I don't know. I could be wrong. Sell myself short. But, um, so yeah, I did get a trading pin, but it doesn't tell me exactly. It just, like it says right here, it just tells me what I got, but like right there, it says a trading pin, but it's not the one I did get. So it says, it says like, you know, style varies, you know, so it doesn't give the actual, what it is. It'd be kind of nice if they actually told, like, they, yeah, they said give you a trading pin, but it'd be nice to be the one that you actually got and not one that you don't got. So you can at least know and they can tell you like, hey, you got the pin of blah, 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 blah. But, you know, but I can't control people when they put stuff. So, I mean, I'm not trying to say what to do, but it'd be just maybe helpful. But anyways, guys, that is the end of the box opening. This one was very exciting. I'm so overwhelmed with it. I did like the Mickey Mouse um, ball cap. And I did love the Beauty and the Beast coloring book, which I was like, yes. And of course, you know, the Lion Guard um, colored pencils, I think they put there, I wish it would be kind of more of what, what was really the actual thing, but probably that's all you could find. So the Lion Guard colored pencils kind of go with the, the coloring book, but you know, but anyways, I did enjoy this one and the training pen too, you know, maybe I could get some more of those because those would be kind of fun to get and start making my own collection. And then when I do go back to Disney, I could start trading people for some more rare ones that you can get at the park or whatever, or I'll buy some either or. But, um, but, so, yeah, this one was very interesting. And like I said, I think they kind of listened to my last video. I don't know if any of them are watching. I could be wrong. I'm just sitting there because I said in the last video that there was no Beating the Beast. And I was kind of upset about it because I am a Beating the Beast fan. And, long behold, when I did open my box, there was a Beating the Beast coloring book. So they still are, I don't know if one of them is still listening or not, but, but thank you guys. But, but also guys, I not, I'm not um endorsed by them or anything or not sponsored by them but i am still going to like still going to praise them but please if if you are a disney big disney fan and still like you know and like to get disney things or you know items the walt life is a very very good company to go by they have three different tiers for you you know of how much you want to spend so i would suggest to actually go there and try it out i mean you don't have to try you can try for a month and see if you liked it so I'm not trying to, but like I'm saying, I'm not sponsored, but I'm just really, really, I am a very adamant believer that the Walt Life box is a very, really awesome box. So, so anyways, guys, this is it for the unboxing, and please and like and share this video, and please subscribe, and if you do subscribe, just hit that bell down below to know when I post. I post at least once a week, maybe twice, if there's something special I want to do. Or I have something special to say. So, so yes. And also, just remember, you guys are all a book. And it's still being written. So, I'll see you guys all next time.